The Ansari X Prize was a space competition in which the X Prize Foundation offered a $10 million prize for the first non-government organization to launch a reusable manned spacecraft into space twice within two weeks. It was modeled after early 20th century aviation prizes, and aimed to spur development of low-cost spaceflight. Created in May 1996 and initially called just the X Prize, it was renamed the Ansari X Prize on May 6, 2004, following a multi million dollar donation from entrepreneurs Anousha Ansari and Amir Ansari. The prize was won on October 4, 2004, the 47th anniversary of the Sputnik 1 launch, by the Tier 1 project designed by Bert Rutan and financed by Microsoft co-founder Paul Allen, using the experimental spaceplane SpaceshipOwn. $10 million was awarded to the winner, and more than $100 million was invested in new technologies in pursuit of the prize. Several other X Prizes have since been announced by the X Prize Foundation, promoting further development in space exploration and other technological fields. Topic. Motivation The X Prize was inspired by the Orteg Prize the 1919 prize worth $25,000 offered by New York hotel owner Raymond Orteg that encouraged a number of intrepid aviators in the mid 1920s to fly across the Atlantic Ocean which was ultimately won in 1927 by Charles Lindbergh in his aircraft Spirit of St. Louis. In reading the book, The Spirit of St. Louis during 1994, Peter Diamandis realized that, "...such a prize, updated and offered as a space prize, might be just what was needed to bring space travel to the general public, to jump start a commercial space industry. Diamandis developed a fully formed idea for a suborbital space barnstorming prize and set an initial goal of finding backers to support a $10 million prize. He named it the X Prize, in part because, X could serve as a variable for the name of the person who might later back the prize. Any craft built to win the prize would be experimental, and a long line of experimental aircraft built for the U.S. Air Force had been so designated, including the X 15 that was, in 1963, the first government built craft to carry a human into space, and because, 10 is the Roman numeral X. The X Prize was first publicly proposed by Diamandis in an address to the NSS International Space Development Conference in 1995. The competition goal was adopted from the Spacecube project, demonstration of a private vehicle capable of flying a pilot to the edge of space, defined as 100 km altitude. This goal was selected to help encourage the space industry in the private sector, which is why the entries were not allowed to have any government funding. It aimed to demonstrate that spaceflight can be affordable and accessible to corporations and civilians, opening the door to commercial spaceflight and space tourism. It is also hoped that competition will breed innovation, introducing new low-cost methods of reaching Earth orbit, and ultimately pioneering low-cost space travel and unfettered human expansion into the solar system. NASA is developing a similar prize program called Centennial Challenges to generate innovative solutions to space technology problems. 
Topic contestants 26 teams from around the world participated, ranging from volunteer hobbyists to large corporate backed operations, Acceleration Engineering Advent Launch Services, Website ARCA, Website Armadillo Aerospace, Website American Astronautics Corporation, AERA, Website Bristol Spaceplanes Limited, Website Canadian Arrow The Da Vinci Project, Website Pablo de Leon and Associates, Website Descraft Corporation Flight Exploration Fundamental Technology Systems High Altitude Research Corporation, Website EEL Aerospace Technologies, Website Interorbital Systems, Website Kelly Space and Technology, Website Lone Star Space Access Corporation, Website Microspace, Inc., Website Len Cormier's Panero, Inc., Website Website Pioneer Rocketplane, Website Scaled Composites Tier 1 Project, Winning Team Space Transport Corporation Starchesa Industries, Website Suborbital Corporation TGV Rockets, Website Vanguard Spacecraft Whalen Aeronautics Inc. Some sources mention two other companies, Aeroastro Asterisk Cerulean Freight Forwarding Co., but do not mention Whalen Aeronautics Inc. Topic Winning Team The Tier 1 project made two successful competitive flights, X-1 on September 29, 2004, piloted by Mike Melville to 102.9 km, and X-2 on October 4, 2004, piloted by Brian Binney to 112 km. They thus won the prize, which was awarded on November 6, 2004. In press coverage, the winning team has been variously referred to as Mojave Aerospace Ventures, the corporation that funded the attempt, Tier 1, the project name of Mojave's contest entry, and Scaled Composites, the manufacturer of the craft. As of 2011, the trophy is on display in the St. Louis Science Center in St. Louis, Missouri. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Flight attempts by teams that did not win. Although only the Tier 1 team actually launched a spacecraft into suborbital space, several other teams have conducted low-altitude tests or announced future plans to launch into space. ARCA launched Demonstrator 2B rocket on September 9, 2004 at Cape Midia Air Force Base in Romania. It was the first flight of a reusable monopropellant rocket. The Da Vinci project originally announced that their first flight would be on October 2, 2004, but this was postponed indefinitely on September 23, 2004, as they were unable to obtain a few necessary components in time. No flight ever occurred. The Canadian Arrow team conducted a successful full power engine test in 2005 and announced on June 2, 2005, that it had received permission from the Canadian government to use Cape Rich as a future launch site. On August 8, 2004, Space Transport Corporation's Rubicon 1 and Armadillo Aerospace's unnamed test vehicle, in two separate unmanned test launches, both crashed and were destroyed. On February 15, 2005, AERA Corporation formerly American Astronautics announced its plans to send seven paying passengers into space as early as 2006, a full year before the first announced speculative Virgin Galactic flight. List of major donors by order of donation Anousha Ansari and Amir Ansari, the official sponsors of the competition
First USA, J.P. Morgan Chase, $1 million New Spirit of St. Louis Organization Danforth Foundation, $500,000 Tom Clancy, $100,000 $500,000 J.S. McDonnell, McDonnell Douglas Andrew Taylor, Enterprise Rent A Car Andrew Beale, Beale Bank Street. Louis Science Center Topic Organization With the Ansari X Prize, the X Prize Foundation, based in Santa Monica, CA, established a philanthropic model in which offering a prize for achieving a specific goal stimulates entrepreneurial investment that produces a tenfold or greater return on the prize purse and at least 100-fold in follow-on investment and social benefit. The foundation has developed into a non-profit prize institute that conceives, designs and manages public competitions for the benefit of humanity. Funding <inaudible> 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 The funding for the U.S. $10 million prize was unconventional in being backed by an insurance policy to guarantee that the $10 million is in place on the day that the prize is won." Diamandis referred to this as a hole-in-one insurance policy Topic spin-offs The success of the X Prize competition has spurred spin-offs that are set up in the same way. There have been two major spin-offs at this point, the first of which is the M Prize, short for Methuselah Mouse Prize, which is a prize set up by University of Cambridge biogerontologist Aubrey de Grey, which will go to the scientific team that successfully extends the life or reverses the aging of mice, which would then eventually be available to humans. The second is the NASA Centennial Challenges, which consist of among others, the Tether Challenge in which teams compete to develop superstrong tethers as a component to space elevators, and the Beam Power Challenge which encourages ideas for transmitting power wirelessly. An independent spin-off called the N Prize was started by Cambridge microbiologist Paul H. Deer in 2007, designed to foster research into low-cost orbital launches. The X Prize Foundation itself is developing additional prizes, the Archon X Prize, to advance research in the field of genomics, the Automotive X Prize, an engineering competition to create a fuel-efficient clean car, the Wirefly X Prize Cup, an annually held air and space exposition featuring space-related competitions and rocketry, and the Google Lunar X Prize, a competition for private funded lunar exploration. Of several awards on offer, the largest, $20 million, will be awarded to the first privately funded team to produce a robot that lands on the Moon and travels 500 meters feet across its surface. There is also a possible H prize, focused on hydrogen vehicle research, although this goal has been addressed by HR 5143, an X prize inspired bill passed by the United States House of Representatives, which was later folded into the Energy Independence and Security Act of 2007. Topic. See also Ansari X Prize Tier 1, SpaceshipOne plus White Nightone Black Sky, The Race for Space 2004 Telefilm, Discovery Channel documentary about the Ansari X Prize 
How to Make a Spaceship 2016 book by Julian Buthrey, about the Ansari X Prisa Similar topics NASA Centennial Challenges Orteg Prize List of Science and Technology Awards Prizes named after people America's Space Prize Methuselah Mouse Prize, or M Prize modeled after the Ansari X Prize N Prize, a low-budget orbital satellite insertion challenge related technical topics Specific Impulse Cholkovsky Equation Delta V Topic. Further reading The X Prize — an article by Ian Parker on pages 52–63 of the 4 October 2004 issue of The New Yorker.